Like and subscribe to my channel and click the bell icon to get new video updates. Hulu plans to release documentary Freaknik. Hulu releases Freaknik documentary started in the mid-80s by HBCU students at the Atlanta University Center. Freaknik quickly grew into an annual retreat, attracting thousands of young black Americans. Freaknik, the Atlanta-born cultural phenomenon, Aka Black Spring Break. Freaknik, the wildest party never told currently in development at Hulu, narrates the rise and fall of a small HBCU picnic in Atlanta, that exploded into an influential street party and ATL, as spotlight on a major cultural stage, according to the streaming platform, Per Variety. As previously reported by Thegrio, Freaknik was started in the mid-80s by HBCU students at the Atlanta University Center, which currently includes Clark Atlanta University, the Morehouse College, Morehouse School of Medicine and Spelman College by 1994, Around 200,000 people flocked to Atlanta to attend the event. At its peak, Freaknik reportedly attracted a quarter of a million visitors, as previously reported by Thegrio. However, the festival eventually came under scrutiny over concerns about security, logistics and suspected illegal activity, according to Complex in 1998. The Atlanta Committee for Black College Spring Break told the Associated Press, we cannot support events that involve indecent activity, sexual assault, violence against women and public safety concerns, fire engines cannot reach victims, and ambulances cannot reach hospitals in time. The mayor halted the citywide party because it was becoming too much of a municipal expense, and required a large police force to keep the activities under control. Figrio previously reported, after a nearly decade hiatus, the annual celebrations returned in 2019, with a more family-friendly rebrand. The last Freaknik event was held in October 2022 as a birthday party for rapper 21 Savage. The celebration was attended by stars including Drake, Lizzo and Atlanta native Lado, according to the event's Twitter page. According to Variety.